this won't hold long. Pilgrim Sanctuary has some new caretakers. That sentry droid could be trouble.
Stop them! Enemy approaching. together. idea what's under their noses but they'll find the safe house eventually let's keep moving Sign of the path safe house yet. cover from Imperial scanners.
fight with me. Just find him. Strange.
Okay, getting closer. Let's check it out. There was a scramble to evacuate. Quickly, everyone! This way! Hurry! Are you coming with us? I must remain here a little longer. Go now, there is no time. I will seal the passage behind you. May the Force be with you all. Master Junda, you use the force, you're Cal Kestis. It's time to go. The Empire's closing in. Yes, which is why this must make it back to Master Junda. These contact codes cannot fall into the hands of the Empire. with me.
Desert Ghost.
How did you do that? A ritual I learned when I returned to Dathomir. It is taxing. You okay? I am fine. Come on. Let's get these coats to see her. Let's keep going. You are Master Junda's friend. My thanks. I would not travel by day if I were you. The Empire's presence has grown. Wise counsel. I am in your debt. Yeah, yeah! Thanks for the assist. Watch your step, lad! Have we walked in on another dangerous expedition? Well, the feral sneakfish prefers the taste of crab, but would happily settle for your two. Are you sure all this is worth the risk? There's great beauty in peril, lad. And these noble beasts demand respect, you know, as you'll see. Noble beast demanding great respect. Yeah, 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 you're right, you're right. I'll deal with you later. Shall we continue me, uh, sordid tale? So, you wish to hear of a time on the grapple with the crew of the dread captain, Wanya Quet? Let's hear it. Aye. My tenure began with quite a bump. The moment the grapple hit orbit, her klaxons began to sing. A barrack ship full of lawful types swam out to the stars and healed us. What be the meaning of this? growled our captain. Where's the boat fisher folk? Your transponder codes tell a different tale, came the reply. You be standing on stolen property, you do. Ah, you've rightful caught us, said the captain. Come on aboard, and I'll surrender what was stolen. But scarcely had the lubbers set boot on the deck of the grapnel. When wham! The captain's harpoon skewed them like a quailfish on a spit. Now you can't do that when you're running line, can you? Said the captain to me, grinning in his foulsome way. I'm sorry to say that I picked up the harpoon that black day. For years, I did not toss a fish back into the sea when I caught her. 
Well, that is until... Ah! Blubbered you to death. I'll continue my tale soon, lad. Old Aerotech speeder bikes. Never got to ride one. Sister. We spotted two more patrols on the ridge. What was their heading? Back south. They narrowly missed one of our warehouse caches. The sandstorm has favored us. It likely obscured any signs of passage. Mark the horizon. Contact me if they double back.
You mentioned the Golden Scraton. Anything else I should keep an eye out for? Should you venture into the murkier regions of the Highlands, you could find yourself in the lair of a Suterbon Alpha, a vile thing. You would be wise to keep your distance. And in case I don't? How very Jedi of you. In that case, I would warn that the beast is quick and ferocious, more so on both counts than its lesser brethren. Good to know. Yes, that suits you, noble one. Priceless curio, and in good condition. Could use this. The wisdom you've recovered is a boon to us all. Here you go. That was fated for you. Stay curious, always. Seer, I couldn't save Armaius. He gave his life for this. I'm sorry. I know you did your best, Cal. And the Empire? They did not track us. Hey, Scrapper. Glad you made it back in one piece. Master Kudova, did you find a way across the abyss? No. But you may have, Cal. Boat and I were able to find some interesting data in the archives. Let's show them what we dug up. Centuries ago, the Republic established the colony on Kobol to study a stellar anomaly known as the Abyss. Santari Kree led the research team. That Z with them. Early attempts to navigate the Abyss ended in disaster. The Republic was on the verge of abandoning the project. And then guess who volunteers to fly in alone and discovers a planet on the other side? Dagon. Using the data from his voyage, Kree invented the Abyss Compass to guide others safely to Tannel. The Republic established a settlement, the Jedi built a temple, just like you said, Cal. Regrettably, a time of peace and prosperity was disrupted when Outer Rim Marauders invaded. I saw them too, but... How'd they get across the abyss? They must have stolen a compass. Don't worry, we won't be so careless. Overwhelmed, the Republic abandoned Tanalor, and the Jedi Council ordered Creed to destroy the compass. Dagangera refused and rebelled against the Order. That is a Gendai. They do not often ally with other species. Looks like Ravis has been working with Dagon for a lot longer than we thought. So the Order sent Jedi to secure the compasses. Dagon murders them over it. Jedi. Killing other Jedi. But... Centauri said that Dagon was the key to Tantalor. Maybe he is young Jedi. Despite my efforts, those compasses you brought me were beyond repair. However, records indicate that three were unaccounted for. So you're saying one might still be out there? Yes, and Dagon sent his army to look for it. <laughs> I'd ask you to stay and help us, but... I recognize that look. What look? Hope. That planet could be a haven for those who stand against the Empire. So you coming with us? I mean, Breeze can make room on the Mantis. For all of you. No. This place needs me. The Hidden Path needs me. Cordova? I'm sorry, my friend. But for now, my place is on Jeddah with Seer. Let me prepare a data stick so you'll have access to our research wherever your journey takes you. Let me guess. You're staying too. 
When we first met, I thought that what we shared was unique. Survivors fighting together against the Empire who took our families. Yeah. You helped me realize I wasn't alone. As did you. But there is a galaxy full of people who have suffered as we have. It's as Seer said. Perhaps you have found a sanctuary for them. Perhaps. If we can get to it. I will join you. Besides, it's been far too long since I've made Grease's hair stand on end. See you back on the Mantis night, sister. You're upset about our bias. Aren't you? Of course. But this is not the first life lost in our struggle. And it will not be the last. I know, but we were so close here. Brother Armias served the cause faithfully. And that service lives on through our determination to keep moving forward. What happens to the safe house now? It will be a long time before we can risk sending anyone to collect what remains. Cal. Find Tanelar. Imagine how many lives we could save. We should return to Kobo soon. I'll just need a moment here. The longer we wait, the bolder these raiders grow. What's keeping us? Kobo calls. Right. I'm curious to hear what you make of Dagon Garrus' history. Dagon felt like his life's work was being threatened. That obsession led him astray. <laughs> Sounds all too familiar. What do you mean? You may recall that I had a vision foretelling the fall of the Order. But the Council... Well, let's just say that my warnings fell on deaf ears. In my arrogance, I felt betrayed. But you were right. That's beside the point. I allowed my wounded pride to cloud my judgment. When the purge began, I was still searching for proof that my vision was true. Instead of being there to support Seer and her Padawan. Cal, BD, well-timed. I remembered a second location you might wish to explore. Another temple? Quite so. This one is in the southern desert. And it is quite magnificent. When I visited, I felt the weight of the past upon me. I am sure you will too. Sounds incredible. I think so. Although it was certainly simpler before the Empire increased its presence here. Good luck on Kobo, my friend. Time for us to make our move. There you are. Manus is tuned to perfection and ready to go. <laughs> so where are we going? Back to Kobo. Turns out we need a special compass to navigate the abyss. A compass? Okay, sure, sure. Whatever you say, kid. Oh, and Marin's coming along. Wait, what? Mar Marin's joining us? Why didn't you tell me? I could have cleaned up the place. Oh, this is just perfect. Well, now it's too late to clean the Manus. I hope she doesn't notice. with us. 
Coruscant. We can go back to Coruscant. We're Kobo bound. The Mantis has changed. Oh yeah, Cal and Boat, they ain't exactly the cleaning types. I cleaned this morning. Wait, did I? No, I didn't. That, that's on me. Mara, I didn't know you were coming. Hey, maybe I'll pick up some scar steaks. Why'd you join back up anyways? Seer and I believe Tantalor could be a refuge for those persecuted by the Empire. Persecuted by the Empire, huh? Kinda get crowded. Sit down, kid. It's time to land. Welcome to Kobo. Cal! Cal, so glad you're back! You missed all the action! It was horrible! Did something happen? The Raiders paid us another visit. Took a shine of that droid you fanned. See? They took her, Cal! Carried her right out! She's been droid napped! My saloon better be okay, Turgle. I think you brought this down on us! I'm innocent, Mr. Grease! Promise! Dagon sent them. He's after Tantalor. There must be something more to Z than we realized. Something scrambled up in her memory banks. We have to rescue her. Once he gets what he wants, he'll scrap her for sure. It won't be easy to get her back. The raider base is in the swamp. They gutted an old Luker Hulk battleship from the Clone Wars. We've seen it. Means they got a lot of firepower. As do we. She's right. Now's our time to move. I like where this is going. They already have what they came for. They're back at the fortress feeling safe, complacent. They'll never see it coming. Maybe not. But if you're wrong, then they'll be looking for payback. Not to worry. I will stay here and look after Grease and the others. You sure? I think you two can manage. Just don't let him swim without supervision. Let me know if you need help. Hi, Sax. Name's Mosey. Marin. All right. I'll scout ahead. Meet you there.
welcome. Make yourself at home. Cal, while you're here, could I run something by you? Sure. What have you got? I, I heard some dredge operators discussing a strange structure in the swamp. Almost certainly another High Republic chamber. But I don't like my chances of conducting successful research on the raider's doorstep. Maybe I could check it out for you. Oh, that'd be wonderful. We'll talk soon. Hey, glad you both found Pyloons already. <laughs> Thanks again for the invite. Name's Ash Javi, by the way. I'm Cal. This is BD1. Man. You didn't tell me what a dive this place would be. This saloon has wonky acoustics, weirder customers, and a barely functional refresher. It's perfect. Can't wait to hear what you've got. Pretty sure Grease's old jukebox predates the High Republic. We got you, Cal. Hit up DDEC if you want to hear anything specific. I will. Thanks. A bit busy. Let's see here. So how did you end up on the wrong side of the law? After my studies, I worked in the Republic Tax Collection Agency investigating revenue disputes. You were a tax collector? Sounds pretty legitimate so far really legitimate but it did introduce me to a steady procession of people desperate for things to shake out in their favor so to speak and you helped them out for a price yes but my fee was nothing compared to the price they paid at the hands of a corrupt system whatever you say Moran talk later hmm? so what you do before you came here I used to perform in a medicine show. I was required to dress in garish outfits and read fortunes while others would scam the audience. That sounds a little demeaning. Yes, but the experiences we carry always have a use, Sojourner. When I arrived on Kobo, I noticed a charlatan trying to swindle someone with fool's priorite. How'd you know? He wore long sleeves in the heat. Sleight of hand, huh? I saw a merchant on Karelia do that. An old trick. Well, I stopped the sale, and Doma has been grateful ever since. And the swindler? Tried the trick on the raiders, so I hear. Now is not the time to speak. There he is. Got your first target lined up. Looks like some Hexian hack named Kip Oster has been slinking around Dredger Gorge. This guy likes to catch his prey off guard, so watch your back. Thanks for the tip. Thank me when you turn in his bounty puck. Listen, now that we're partners, Partners, huh? Business associates, best buds, call us whatever you will. Point is, our relationship is an investment. And we've got bigger fish to fry than these raider hacks. I'll get to those bounties. But if my friends are in trouble, they take priority. You're gonna get killed with that attitude, Cal. But on a certain level, I can respect it. Get a move on, will ya? Those bounties won't collect themselves. You got the stuff, I got the good. How about a toast, Tularks? Say, here's hoping we stay spineless and avoid sudden moves. You know you're gonna buy it, so just last. buy it. Ah, yes, a toast. Salt and seed, sickle and oven, baked. To perfection in one or another. Looks good to me. Really? Okay. Safari toast. May we never fail. Heard 
you and Boat are gonna take the fight to the Raiders. Word travels fast around here. A daring assault on the Raider Fortress by the mighty warrior and his gunslinging sidekick to save their droid companion. Yes! Z is lucky to have a friend like you. Hi, Cal. Hey, Monk. You look tired. Take a load off. It was good to see you. Hey, we're thinking of plugging fresh energy cores into the dams at Dredger Gorge. See if we can get them working again. Not a bad idea. Where'd you learn to do that? Old friend of ours. Top-notch engineer. Had a winning smile, too. That he did. Good friend to have around. You'd think. The guy shorted us on our cut after a big take. So, Grok may have left an anonymous tip with the authorities. <laughs> Yeah. Pretty harsh for someone who shorted you on a few credits. He tried to put his thumb in our slice of the pie. And our cut? Huh. That's non-negotiable. There's some folks don't deserve a second chance. Especially not the greedy ones. I'll keep that in mind. What? Seems like the Raider problem here is getting worse on the daily. They've got a new leader. No surprise they're getting bolder. Well, I guess that's why they call it hazard pay. Not much to be done, is there? Talk like that's gonna get us both killed. Oh, yeah? Well, let's get his take. What do you propose we do, Cal? You should avoid the Raiders. Scrapping is dangerous, but they're worse. Kid's right, Dana. No more jobs on gang turf. Too risky with them Raiders. Ha! <laughs> I ain't gonna be intimidated by a few goons with attitude. This is just what we scrappers do. We grab anything that looks valuable. And hope it isn't load-bearing. Yeah, I get it. But you're underestimating the Raiders. Due respect, we've made it this far. And there's no way I'm quitting. We're... <laughs> right. No way we're quitting now. Come back later, yeah? Anyone tell you about the Mogu around the swamp? There's a Mogu there? Yep. And this one's a whopper. It can snap your arms off like puerco sticks. We'll see. Well, if you're crazy enough to try, your best bet is to avoid its mud throws. Good tip. Thanks for keeping an eye out while we go after Z. If the Raiders return, we will make them regret it. I reckon we're gonna get along just fine. I think so. Go, Cal. Z needs you. Be seeing ya. Hey, kid. I got some bad news on our favorite Ordo Eris fanatic. I already know Sork Tormo's put a fresh bounty on my head. You do? One of your regulars clued me in on his game. She's been keeping tabs on the Haxian Brood, so this time we've got the jump on him. Jeez. You figure that guy would let things go by now. Hey, I was thinking, now that Marin's back in the crew, we could always head to Coruscant. Not that I want to. Ah, what? Cast your eyes over this beauteous tank. Glad you came around to it. Hey, didn't he make a fetching first impression? Have a mind to get our third scrubbing. Cleaning the filter, you think someone tried to crab a boss through a sieve? Oh, can't unhear that. Not bad. 
I've seen worse rooftop gardens. I've cleared another plot for you. Thank you for growing plants to their full potential. Hi, Peely. So far, Kobo has been a welcoming home. And this rooftop's energy drew me towards it. You feel a connection to this garden? Yes. We will help each other grow. Looks like you've already started. Divines? Yes, they sprouted overnight. But there's so much more to discover. If you plant new seeds, I'll tell you all about them. But, much like healthy roots, do not overextend yourself. Grow the plants we have, and I'll clear more garden space in due time. I see you planted a spine fluff. They are quite adorable, but beware. Nested amongst those plumes are some claw-sharp needles. Let's sow some new seeds. Your effort gives rise to new life. That's a new species. Better hear what Peely has to say about it. Here's your new home. There you go, little seed. Some striking variants here. Let's plant this here. Let's stop.
Well, there it is. Got your mark, I'm coming in. You made it. Anyone spot you? Me? <laughs> Not a chance. What are we dealing with? Any sign of the droid? Some kind of service gantry. Could be a way in. It's the best option I can see. Only way to the Lucre Hulk is through this swamp. For you, maybe. You want to ride, BD? <laughs> when you're ready, make a move on that gantry. I'll be watching. Copy that. That's one way not to get mud on your boots, huh? Now we just need to rescue Z. <clears throat> Hard to believe anything could live in this swamp. I guess our friend here makes it work. See that building, buddy? Guess someone does live here. Or did once. do you think this is worth? Nothing's worth crossing the Raiders. Now move. I'm not leaving you here. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. But we must find my data bag. Let's check this place out. Can we just get you a new one? Absolutely not! My entire life is on that data pad. Cal, what are you doing out here? I could ask you the same question, Zig. I came out here to look for Z. Yeah, me too. Ahem, and I am Winnie Eres. Cal, was it? We've only just met, but I could use some assistance. What do you need? I was told there's a bird in this swamp that spots a resplendent blue marsh. But when I tried to get a closer look at one, it snatched my data pad and flew away. Where'd it go? They've got a nest at the top of a spire nearby. I'd go, but Winnie here says I gotta stay by her side. Yes! Yes, that spire there! It's so close, yet so far. I'll see what I can do. You shine like the stars. Oh, <laughs> that's a Coruscant saying. Perhaps a more simple. Thank you, Cal. Good luck finding that data pad, Cal. And be safe. Those gliders perch in high places. Please. That data pack contains all my designs, not to mention my reference data bank. Without it, I'll be starting all over from scratch. I mean, even more than I already am. Dangerous spot to catch a fish. Nay, dangerous fish to catch a sport. Sure. Aye, that one swept the line. But sarcasm is weak bait. Besides, I've gathered my focus for my quarry, the fearsome glotsam crab. One of my old crew, a mate on the grapnel, once tried to pluck a crab from the sea foam when suddenly, wham, overboard she went. Serve ye on the roiling waves of Manan. 
but it does make the Caesar's soul easier to brook. No? Stay a moment, and I'll regale you with the next chapter of a tale. Aye, so we return to my time on the Grabnel. Against the protestations of my heart, I forsook the rod and line for the harpoon. For years, we trawled the outer rim, sparing every fish that happened across our path. Talented as I was, I spared more fish than the rest of the crew. Put together, fool as I was, I didn't have the wisdom to be ashamed. The dread captain, Wanyak Wet, took notice. He showered me in brevets, gave me the best of catches, and scarcely a year after I left Sakavi Tar, I became his first mate. Shortly after my promotion, we were on our way to Manan to sell the carcass of a goober fish. But, wham! Just as we dove out of hyperspace and the great ocean world straight into view, so did she. The most glorious creature I'd ever beheld. A whale of marvelous proportion. But swimming through Manan's orbit like it was nothing but an easterly current back home. I was transfixed. No kidding. How close did you get? Funny you should ask. I didn't have long to set me eyes above before he crashed headlong into her. The grapnel burst off her like chum of flotsam. We plummeted down to the ocean, sundering the grapnel on the sea floor, where a gang of pirate quarren were holed up. The filthy Zephyrs. We swam out of the riven hull and found ourselves surrounded by quarren, demanding all manner things, including our bounty of fish. So, away we swam, Captain White, the crew, and myself. But, blind as we were at such depth, we shortly ran into a dead end, finding ourselves surrounded by quarren. Find me again, and I'll continue the tale. <laughs> Deeds. Let's take him back to the garden. Healy could tell us more. I can't move that, but there's no other way up to the pillar either. Over here, BD. I'll check it out. Gotta keep moving. You ever been in a ship this big before, buddy? It's been a long time for me. Not looking forward to it. But Z's in there. We're not leaving without her.
one's here. the eccentric High Republic droid? Yeah. You? Well, I'm here, aren't I? Ready? Always. I'll go high. Such a warm welcome. I guess knocking isn't an option. We'll find our own way. Any ideas, Cal? Think you can break that coupling? Let's find out. When in doubt. that, bud? should have crossed us. Okay, let's focus. C needs us. This piece of junk could sink any second. Nah, she'll hold. Just wait to see what's inside. Huh? 
broke into a freighter on the nav once. Yeah? Any tips? No. It was nothing like a lucre hulk. Not sure why I even mentioned it. Could you clear this up? Absolutely. Enemy's close. I got your back, Cal. Jetpack, huh? You are muddled. Oh, I am. And you are supported. <laughs> you will confirm. Let's see. Attack landing. Were those droids arguing? It happens more than you think. <laughs> no wonder they lost. Come on, let's go. I'll make sure the coast is clear. Miss me, BD? Too easy. Uh, it's always worth a shot. Stay alert. If anyone comes this way, kill them. Roger, Roger. They will be eviscerated. Oh, this one understands. They're on to us. No mercy. It's enemy of nothing. Ah. I'm with you, Cal. You got me. There. Never doubt it. Keep going. I'll scout around. Make sure there are no surprises. Be careful.
scaling a beaten up warship, just like the old days. Where are they going? assist. Conquer a whole planet with this. Stay alert. We have reports of hostiles in the area. We're under attack? Here? Ready for <gasps> battle? Keep this area locked down. Whatever Ravis is up to, it's drawn some unwanted attention. And the other things here. <laughs> knows we're here now, huh? Must 
be bowed. Come on. All you, BD. Cal, get it! Stem. Be happy that Marin joined the crew? Yeah. Glad she wants to help us find Tannel. Wait, you hear that? Destroyer droids. Perfect. Shield? That's all of them. First time I fought Droidica was with my master during the Clone Wars. I froze. He had to take them out. Look at you now. Bet he'd be proud. Hope so. Enemies close. What you talking about? Whatever you say, Cal. Hey, BD, a little help? Okay, let's see what we have here. A turbo lift. Is that who I think it is inside? Let me get a closer look. Yeah, it's Z. Where does it go? The control tower. And that's our target. I see a problem down there. Droids. We've seen worse. Check out those AATs. I've got a plan. So I figure I make some noise, draw them away, you slip by. Regroup at the turbo lift. What do you think? It's risky. We passed risky a while back. Good luck. You too. Full of craft. An army. 
all ours. Ready to scour this planet for my lost master. When it's time, I'll signal. What signal? Trust me, you won't miss it. serve a new master. It's locked down. Victory cannot be stopped. I'll never give in.
ought to test my work. Droid, kill them. Roger, roger. to the turbo lift. Well, let's look for one together. Do what you gotta do, buddy. Always on point.
Check this out. Could you wire it up? I've got an idea. Okay. Now what? <laughs> Not bad. What are these buildings? The technical term is yurts. Living quarters. Saw them on Merrick 9. You never seen so many yurts. Living quarters. We're in deep now. Some company, and it isn't friendly. Get him back. Let's get this. Got a scan? Raiders have gotten pretty cozy here. We'll need some living space. Homes. Homes? Sure. You've never been to Marek 9? Reports of Jedi in the area. Heightened state of alert. Your program ensuring Enemies change nearby. to the law. Watch out! Target is a Jedi! I'll be a person! <laughs> Toss them. Ravis only wants the intact ones. Hold on. Give me that. Good eye. We're locked out. That's how you do it. a real threat this Jedi makes a change for prospectus even if it's more dangerous I have come this far just to die <laughs> Making the hermit. Sorry. I need a 
Almost in, buddy. Once we get through this, Kata and I can finally rest. More quiet and peaceful. Like it used to be. Almost like it used to be. Get that down. Consider it done. <laughs> this is no time to let up, Cal. <laughs> Thank you. 